from the Rainbow Room, high atop the RCA building in New York City. The year was 1934 when the Rainbow Room first opened its doors. For decades, it served as the place for New York's elite to gather, dine, and dance. Located on the 65th floor of 30 Rockefeller Plaza, it became an instant New York classic playing host to A-list stars and a backdrop to many Hollywood films. And now for something I call the power of the Jade Scorpion. In 2009, the iconic club closed its doors. However, after a five-year absence from the New York City skyline, the Rainbow Room is back, reclaiming its former glory. Well, we're happy that we were able to reopen right around the 80th anniversary of when the Rainbow Room opened in October 1934. A lot of the features are landmarked, and this is the 114th interior landmark in New York City. So the revolving dance floor where we're standing, the dome ceiling, the crystal chandeliers, the wall sconces, those are all landmark features of the space. We have this incredible view, which is complemented by our lovely new Preciosa crystal curtains. Each window has over 1,200 individual pieces, and they all form this really beautiful little prism effect during the day, which is great. But then at night, it just makes the entire city sparkle. It's almost like an extension of the sky itself. The future's brighter. There is not a bad seat in the house. So smile, smile, smile. Which famous feet have walked right through here that you can share with us? Well, of course, Elizabeth Taylor certainly was a frequent guest here. Muhammad Ali, Barbara Streisand actually did the premiere party here from Funny Girl. So there's been a parade of celebrity through the space. But one of the things that was important to us is that the Rainbow Room be accessible to everyone. So we're open two days a week, Monday night for the dinner and the dancing and then on Sundays for an amazing Sunday brunch. Dining and dancing here isn't exactly cheap. Monday night's prefix starts at $175 a person. Sunday brunch, $95. And what happens during the other days of the week and the weekend? We host special events here, but we also have Lounge 65, which is open to the public Monday through Friday. So that way there's always something for the visitors to enjoy. Come fly with me, let's fly, let's fly away. So welcome to 65. This is fabulous. Central Park looks so close to us. It is. It is one of the most fabulous views of Central Park from Midtown Manhattan. Whether you come for the history, food, or the sweeping views, we can all cheers to the Rainbow Room waltzing its way back to its iconic status. Cheers. cheers.